This is not financial advice, not legal advice for entertainment and educational purposes only. And anything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in these videos. That being said, hit the like button, subscribe button, all that YouTube algorithm stuff so you get the videos I put them out. See what I'm thinking, see I'm analyzing that data. Look, I tell every day, the day they release us is false. Many gives a false narrative of the market so we can make bad trading decisions. Listen, the bad actors are doubling down on the criminality to control the price of AMC. They've pushed it down below 450. It's currently at 425 as of this recording. But what these bad actors don't know is that retail investors are not selling. We know exactly what they're doing. We are on to their schemes. And what they don't realize is we have learned how to trade over the past 36 months. As you can see, what I did was I bought 100 more shares of AMC today. But did I pay for it out my pocket? No, I didn't pay for it out my pocket. I use a trading scheme that I learned because of the bad actors' criminal behavior. Because had they not forced me to stay in the play for 36 months, I would not have been forced to learn how to play the market. 36 months ago, if you asked me what a covered call was, I would have no idea what it was. If you asked me what a call option was, what a put option was, I would have no idea what you were talking about. But look what I did. Look at the top. I took a safe covered call. I rolled it out for one week. I rolled it out for one week, made $440. And with that $440, I bought an additional 100 shares of AMC at this reduced price. Now, had they let AMC run the way it was supposed to, they probably would have gotten all my money back already. You know why? Because I did not know how to trade. I was really not familiar. What I would do is I would buy a stock. And if it goes up, I would sell and take a profit. And if it started going down, I would sell it fast, hoping not to take too much losses. And I believe that's how a majority of retail investors traded the market i had no idea about covered calls put calls credit spreads butterflies iron condors i had no idea what those things were so while what the bad actors have done to us is absolutely